Anything else in the world. No way! You wouldn't say that, especially not a dead person. Wow, well, then! What did he say, huh? What did he say? <laughs> I am the brave combat you! And one prince of a guy. And we are big men. We are stuck in every night. 
Whoa! What's that? <laughs> it says here her name is Snow White. I'll say. She's really pale. I should take her back to my castle and show my friends. Men! Uh-uh, that is not what happened. I'm the handsome prince, charming, and we are his handsome men. We are applying the highest peaks and flush the best of the best Behold, the fair Snow White. I love you more than anything. <laughs> What's the joke? No, no, tell me what's the joke. I would love to know what the joke no, is. Sorry, 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 I just remembered something. Yeah, sorry, you, you, yeah, sorry, you sorry. love her more than I love you more than anything else in the world. No way, he wouldn't say that. <laughs> I am the brave combat you and one prince of a guy. And we are great men. We have stuck behind you. Yes. What? What's... What's that? It says here her name is... Snow White. I'll see. She's real pale, boy. Wow. <laughs> I, I think she's dead. I should take her back to my castle and show my friends. Men! Uh-uh, that is not what happened. It's true! It's not! It's true! Ah! Look, you two, make up your mind. Chancellor, I will sign those papers tomorrow, please. I ease up, oh gosh. <clears throat> what are you doing, my dear? Sewing and wishing. Wishing, my love? For what? Tell me, and it's yours. It's nothing you can buy. Nothing I can't buy, my love? I wish for a child of <laughs> a, a child, my love. <laughs> in time, in time, I promise. Ow! What's wrong? I pricked my finger. Look at her red the bird is on the white snow. 
I wish for a child with skin as white as snow, lips as red as blood, and hair as black as the wind. That one makes sense, right? Good. I'm just joking, my love. Soon, soon, I promise. Red as blood? Cool! You are so immature! Could you two just listen? Soon after that, she had a little daughter. Congratulations, Your Majesty. It's a girl. She, she's beautiful. Well, this should be a joyous day. Should, Doctor? But I have bad news, sire. Bad news, you say? Apologies, Your Majesty. I'm afraid. I'm, I'm afraid the queen has died. What? What? The, the, Your queen, Majesty, the queen has. I tried. I'm out. just a country doctor. I said out, doctor. My, my beloved wife. Us. But here is our beautiful daughter with skin as white as snow, lips as red as blood, and hair as dark as night. I shall name her Snow White in honor of her mother's dying wish. After some time, the king took himself another wife. She was a beautiful woman. Indeed, I am. But she was proud and arrogant. Excuse me? And she could be stand it if someone was to surpass her in beauty. news do you have for me today? You, my queen, are the fairest in the land. <coughs> oh, darling, I know. Gentlemen, a limerick for your enjoyment. There once was a queen so big, her mirror could not call her plain. If she didn't say, You're beautiful today. Her anger would cause him great pain. <laughs> but wait, there's more. Our wit, you will adore. So give us your full attention. Just lend us an air. But have no fear. Your problems, 
We will not mention. Oh, when I look in the mirror, I'm happy to see that no one is as nearly as pretty as me. One look in the mirror reveals what is true, that I am so much better looking than you. <laughs> We're pretty and lovely, so charming you see, and we are the envy of all we see. <laughs> just rotten. Her stare makes you quick. No, I grew up and became ever more beautiful. When she was just seven years old, she was already as beautiful as the light of day. Until one day, she was even more beautiful than the queen herself. Snow White is so bad. Ladies and gentlemen, another limerick for your enjoyment. Very 
pretty sight. Her stepmother, the queen, was really quite me. I think Snow White should take flight. <laughs> <laughs> Mirror on the wall. Who in this land is fairest of all? You, my queen, are fair, it's true. But Snow White is a thousand times fairer than you. What? I... What did you say? Snow White is a thousand times fairer than you. you into a thousand pieces. How would you like that? What should we lie though? I don't lie. What she talking about? What's the going on here, boy? Lie? Me? What? I... <laughs> That's a hammer. Yeah. Your majesty, <laughs> not today. than me. <coughs> well, I call it as I see it, Your Majesty. Yes, your 
Majesty? Fetch me my fine handkerchief box from my room. Summon my huntsman. My queen. You are my loyal servant. Of course, your majesty. And you'll do whatever I ask? Of course, your majesty. Come close. Not so close. Snow White out into the woods. I never want to see her again. My lady, I don't think I am. Kill her! And as proof that she is dead, bring back her lungs and her liver to me. Deliver them to me in this box. You want me to kill her? My lady, this must be some kind of joke, right? Do you see me laughing? My lady, th there's no way you could possibly... You could possibly... You can't. My lady, please don't make me do this. Snow White is so, so gentle, so caring, so lovely. What? Just... Uh, my, my lady, I cannot kill such a delicate flower. <laughs> um, your majesty, your majesty? Well, you can't. Your, ma Can your you? majesty. Your Majesty! You will do as I say, or you yourself will die. Yes, Your Majesty. Yes, Your Majesty. Leave! The huntsman obeyed and took Snow White into the woods. As a child, my father told me, blessed are we, remember this, life's not that long, it is, but moments to be savored, filled with bliss, there are treasures around us everywhere for us to behold. I see silver, I see gold, <laughs> emeralds, isn't it lovely here?
Bird. How are you today? Better than you, I swear. Why, little bird? How can you say such a thing? It is such a lovely day, and the huntsman yonder has been kind enough to be my protector as I gather these lovely flowers. Yonder huntsman means to harm you. <laughs> what? Oh, I am sure you are mistaken. I have known him since I was very young. He, he is a good and kind man. Listen to me, Snow White. I speak the truth. It has traveled to the forest, carried on the wings of my brothers and sisters. He intends to kill you.
Do what? Cause I could, I, I could, I could, I could kill a wild animal. Perhaps I could kill a hog. Yes, stupid. Yes, stupid. <laughs> At least now you're thinking. Okay. We, I don't know where to find a hog. What was I thinking? Okay, I can just. Excuse me. But did I hear somebody say something about killing a wild animal? Uh, yes? What's your name? I'm Horatio the Huntsman. Who are you? I'm Francis Boisel, representative for the Ministry of Agriculture. Everybody calls me Papa Bois. Wait, 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 wait. You're who? From where? Papa Bois is my name. Here I am, forestry man. I'm Papa Bois, I protect your land. Yes, folks, forest protection. We have been protecting the forest since 1945. And even back then, they knew that we had to protect and preserve our beautiful nation of Trinidad and Tobago. Protecting is where I come in. Hold on a second. So you're saying you've been here for all these years and this is the Here I am, forestry man. I'm Papa Bois, I protect your land. Are you aware, sir, that what you're doing is illegal? It's illegal? Yes, sir. In this forest? Yes, sir. You're joking, right? Hard luck. No. What? 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 I... Ignorance I... of the law is not an excuse. I've heard it all before. Uh, I'm sorry, but what job do you have exactly? I still don't even know why Here you're in the I what? am forestry man. I'm Papa Bois, I protect your land. I'm going have you hugged a tree today? Hugged a tree? Call me, we have some questions what? I need to answer. Wait, questions? Hold on. Oh, you wanna play talk? Who do you think you, you are? wanna play talk? I'm the Huntsman here. You, you wanna play talk? How do you know? Our friends the birds told us your story. Then, then they will have told you that. I have nowhere to go. I, I'm frightened and all alone and I don't know what to do. We will help you to the wine. We will guide you to a safe place. Oh my goodness, look at this cute little house. Everything is so little, really, really little. And look at this table with seven little chairs and seven little plates and spoons. Whoever lives here must be very small. 
perhaps it's children. Oh my, and look at this food. Oh, I'm so hungry. Perhaps they wouldn't mind if I had just a little nibble. And a bed with seven little pillows. Oh, how cute. I'm so tired. Uh, this, this bed looks so comfortable. Perhaps they wouldn't mind if I just rest on it and, and wait for the people who live here to come home. going on here? Who has been sitting in my chair? And who has been eating from my plate? And who has been eating my fruit? Who has eaten my vegetables? And who has been sticking with my fork? <laughs> there was one other. Who has been cutting with my knife? Who has been drinking from my, my mug?
let's sneak up on it and we can attack it. That's not. That's not. We have enough. We can say we did though. Yes. For heaven's sake, we don't even know what we're dealing with here. Well, yes. what do you think? Yes. It, it's not moving anymore. Maybe it's asleep. Maybe. Should we have a look? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think you should go and have a look. If one goes, we're all going together. Come on, man. We're big men. We're big men. On my count. One. One. Two. Two. One. Five. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. One. One. Two. Two. Three. Three. Oh my god! She's so beautiful. Where's she come from? She's quite big, isn't she? Only to you. Should we should we wake up? No, no, no. no. Okay, oh, sorry, sorry. Let us sleep. We found a story in the morning. But hey, where are we go I mean where are we go where are we go sleep? Yeah, where are we go sleep. Grab a pillow. I see body floor. The floor. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Mother had tried to kill her, how the huntsman had spared her life, and that she had been running the entire day until finally stumbling upon their house. The dwarves tricked her and invited her to stay. Oh, wasn't that sweet? Oh, brother. Now the queen believed that the huntsman had brought her back the lungs and liver of Snow White. What she didn't know was that the huntsman bought the lungs and liver at a market and she could only believe that she was once again the fairest of them all. <laughs> ah, it's a beautiful day, isn't it? <clears throat> Ladies! Yes, Is there anything you wanted to say to me today? Hmm? the wall. Who in this land is fairest of all? You, my queen, are fair, it's true. But little Snow White with the seven dwarves is a thousand times fairer than you. <laughs> what? alive and well and living with the seven dwarves, she thought and thought again about how she could kill her. Isn't that against the law? Isn't what against the law? Killing someone, isn't it against the law? Of course it is, okay? Now shut up and listen. Mama, you don't come and then shut up. Peggy Sue, there's a nicer way to tell your brother to stop talking. 
Yeah, but mom, it doesn't work with him. Yes, it does. Look, Josh, it is illegal. No, please. Huh. I could ask one more thing. What is it? Doesn't somebody do something kind of hold for you? Oh. You're kidding, right? Josh, this is your imagination. You can make them any size you want using your imagination. You're probably right. You are so stupid. Mama, you look so stupid. Could you just stop fighting for one minute? In the meantime, the word about Snow White's arrival was starting to fly around the local dwarf village. Show me the way to the market. Um, um, uh, why? 
Uh, surely, miss, right this, this way. You, uh, see what that, um, uh, mango tree is? Yes. Uh, uh, miss? Miss? Uh, yeah, yes. You're making a right at that mango tree, then yeah. you're making a left. Of course. You're making a left. You're going okay. straight and you're coming across a square roundabout. <coughs> I know it sounds weird, but a square roundabout. Alright? Then you're making a left. Then okay. you're making a left. Yeah. And it's the uh, general store, correct? I, I... Right, it was the general store. Okay, the general store, you make a left. General store is the left of the red house with the white roof with a green and red gate in the front with a red mailbox. You can't miss it. Legit, you can't miss it. Oh. <laughs> and that's how you reach the store. Thank you, ma'am. You're welcome. Wait, aren't you kind of tall for a dwarf? Oh, well, as a matter of fact, I hold the record for the world's tallest dwarf. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yep. Wow, I think that's impressive. Thank you. You're welcome.
should do it. Works perfectly. She'll never recognize me as an old peddler woman. And now to finish the task. Okay, all right, all right, all right. But, but I'll be fine. Really, I will. Look, I know you think that, but you don't know how crafty she can be. And we only say this for your protection. And we ask our friends in the village as well. Yeah. Excuse me. Excuse. Excuse me. Can I have your attention, please? Can you please look out for our dear Snow White? Please. Sure. <laughs> of course. And can you keep a sharp eye out for the evil queen coming through Snow White anyhow? Yeah. Yes, yes, yes. Look, 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 look. You, you could enjoy your day shopping, but when you're home alone, lock the door. She would never try anything in front of all these people. Probably not, but it doesn't hurt to be careful. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <sighs> okay. Well then, we're well, off to work. Love you. Love Bye. you. Bye. Please be safe. Be safe. I love you. Bye. 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 Excuse me, ma'am. Allow me to see those flowers. Just as I thought, under all that bush, you're selling the shaconia. That's illegal. I'm Francis Boisel, representative for Minister of Agriculture. Everybody calls me Papa Bois. Here I am, forestry man. I'm Papa Bois, I protect your land. Yes, folks, once again, forest protection. This beautiful and delicate flower is the national flower of Trinidad and Tobago and is protected by the National Emblem Act. It is illegal to pick or uproot a wild chaconia in this country. Here I am, forestry man. I'm Papa Bois, I protect your land. Are you aware, ma'am, that what you're doing is illegal? Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, no! Our ignorance is not an excuse. I've heard it all before. Heard it all before. It's not. Nah. Here I am, forestry man. I'm Papa Bois. I protect your land. Have you up the tree today? Have you up the tree? If not, go and tell the higher tree now. Now, if you come here, you have some questions to answer. Oh. 
Thank you. Oh, come on. Why not? It wouldn't kill you. That's what she um. thinks. Um, it is awfully pretty. I mean, m maybe just for one minute? Yes, of course. Here. Oh, sure. Oh, take this mirror and see how pretty you look. Oh, it does look pretty. But not so tight. One time. I can't breathe. <coughs> Stop. <coughs> <laughs> I have won. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Hey, somebody. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. I didn't see her. Only an, an old peddler woman. That was her in disguise. Yeah. 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 Oh, God. Yeah. 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 oh okay. Oh, Are you okay? okay? Just glad we got here in time. Oh, Let's God. go. Okay. Come on. Hmm. For real. didn't expect that to work, did you? Yes! Well, no. What? Oh, I don't know. She fell for it easily enough. How was I supposed to know that those meddling dwarves would know how to break the spell? Sis, corset ribbons in this day and age? Oh, please. <laughs> hey, don't you get smart with me, Mira, or I will break you! That somebody has a bad luck and you know it. What am I going to do now? Here I am back at the drawing board. Well, I mean, it's out of time, you need some poison combs. <gasps> they work. They work. They work. They work. They work. The combs. <laughs> oh, yes. That's a wonderful idea. Oh, I am so smart. <laughs> you? No girl can resist brushing her hair with a lovely comb. So I shall present her with such that she cannot resist. And that will be the end of our pretty 
little Snow White. Hmm. First to disguise myself. The right spell is needed. A pinch of this, a pinch of that. A hero dog, I'm so a fat. A squishy bug from where I sat. Mix them all together. That girl is not going to make an old bat out of me. Recognize me. They'll all be expecting an old panda woman. Now to finish the task. Oh, don't forget. What happened? I'll be fine this time. We know you think that, but you don't know how crafty she can be. And you'll recognize the old peddler woman if you see her again, won't you? Y yes? Villagers, villagers! Excuse me. Villagers, would you all look out for the old peddler woman? Listen, listen. Are they calm as she? She old and ugly. Okay. Take care yeah. of yourself, right? Yeah. Of course. No, promise. Yeah. Promise. I promise. Okay. <sighs> Alrighty. I'll, I'll be Love fine. You. I'll be fine. Be safe. Okay. Please. Well then. Yes. Bye. 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 All across the valley, you can hear us wail. We are the seven dwarfs. I'm Zip, I'm Kip. I'm Zip, I'm Kip. I'm Zip, I'm Zip. My name is Big Mike. And together we are the seven dwarfs. See you real soon. Have a great day. Combs, pretty combs, pretty ribbon for pretty hair. Hi, would you like to try one of my combs? Would you like to try one of my combs? Okay, bye bye. Bye bye. Hi, what's your name? I I'm Snow White. Hi, Snow White. Would you like to try one of my combs? Pretty, but no thank you. No, come on, I insist. You insist? Yes, come on. Well, well, well I guess so. It, it does feel really nice. Yeah, these kinds of teeth feel great in the scalp. <laughs> First in the land, I think not. <laughs> Wait, what? What is that? Where is it? Where is it? Go! Back in it! Sit down! Get it, dwarves! Go! That way! Again? Come on! What do you mean? What do you mean again? 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 Are you okay? 
Um, it, yes, I, I think so. Are you serious? You Was it the queen this time? You, you told me to look out for an old peddler woman, but this woman was young and, and pretty. Well, don't talk to no peddler woman on the road. Yeah. Yeah. Otherwise, yeah. you'll okay. end up dead on the ground again. Two times. Two times. Okay, I will. Oh, God. Oh, that's a working girl. Okay. Real mom. Yeah. <laughs> Well, Mira, what say you now? Mm. You, my queen of fair, it's true. But little Snow White, with the seven dwarves, is a thousand times fairer than you. No! Oh, why? Oh, that Snow White will die if it costs me my life. With this little apple, Snow White will meet her end. Injected, pouty little red lips are going to be closed for good. I'm gonna kill Snow White, that's what I'll do. With a poison apple and witch's brew, she'll fall asleep. Won't that be grand when the girl is dead and I'm the fairest chick in the land? And now to disguise myself. Snow White will never recognize me as a man. It might, it might even, it might even. It was true. <laughs> Mara, quickly wake up. Bothering me so. First, you want to break me with a hammer, then you're screaming at me. I didn't even do you not. Hey, 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 hey! Um, Mr. Man, who is you? The Queen. And I just say, Mr. Man, how is the Queen? How? That make it any sense? So, um, sir. <laughs> If you're the queen, you have to prove it to me. Ask me anything now. What's your husband's middle name? Oop, 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 oop. Hi, your majesty. How you doing, sister? <laughs> you good? <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay, I don't understand what's going on. Why are you a man? Because I had to trick Snow White into eating the apple. It went so well. That the apple was so artfully made that I made Snow White have the red cheek. She was so scared that she didn't want to eat it. But I said, I'll cut the apple into two. Here, you eat the half of the beautiful red cheek. But Snow White barely had a bite in her mouth when she dropped her gong dead. What do you say about that? You, my queen, are the fairest in the land. Yes! She's, she's still so beautiful. 
I can't believe she's dead. I keep hoping someday, somehow, maybe the magic can be undone. Hey, 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 Alia! Look, look, the prince coming! What? The, why? Is the prince and his men? What? What is this? Why do you mourn, my good man? We... We... We have lost our fair so white. Snow White? Yes, man, Snow White. The same girl you say that you love and who you want to take you back to your castle. Snow White. <laughs> Ah, yes, the beauty in the glass case. M may I see her? Uh, yes, we should let the prince approach. I've, I've never seen such beauty, even in death. Please, allow me to take her to my castle. I shall build a shrine and protect her always. Uh, uh, take our Snow White. I... We can part with her for all the gold in the world. Uh, please, oh, I, uh, uh, I, I shall honor her and respect her as my most cherished one. Uh, uh, men, 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 let's huddle. God, man, scary. I find him shady. Yeah. I don't trust him. Like, well, like I don't trust him. He was a tick. That's weird. That's weird. But then and she. Um, she. On, 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 Listen, then we should give him all the gifts. Honestly. We could get someone. But I don't like what I got. We could get someone. Yeah. We could ask for something. We could ask for something. We could ask for 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 gold. And and and. No 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 no. Bed. Bigger bed. A food, a food. We have to cook again. Big food. What is big food? Give, give up. We don't know. Give up. Give up. What we should do? What we should do? What we should do? What? Kill him? Kill him? No. Do I do it? No. Uh uh. Okay. Okay, Prince. You may take her, but we must come with you. Uh, 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 yes, yes. Men, the coffin. And lift with care. So, I, I remember taking a bite of a juicy red apple and, and then it got stuck in my throat and, and then nothing. What? I don't know. What? What? I don't know. I don't want When we dropped the coffin. Oh, so when we dropped the coffin, it dislodged the apple from her throat. Bringing her back to us. Oh. But, but where am I? You are with me. <gasps> I am the prince of this land. And I love you more than anything else in the world. Please, come with me to my father's castle. <gasps> oh. <laughs> you shall be... Oh my god. Yeah. My yeah. Yeah. Say it! You shall be my wife. <laughs> I mean, this is all so sudden. I. Yes, yes, yes. Yes.
The magic chains. Magic chains. No. 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 These enchanted chains make you dance forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. Him too. Yeah. Yeah, to be sure. I can make it ten in it. Nah, make it two. Alright, two. I never. And never. Alright. And you will regret the day you ever used your magic for evil. Um, excuse me, ma'am. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Frances Boisel. Everybody calls me Papa Bois. May I say it is a pleasure to meet 
to meet you. Now down to business. Is it true that you had something to do with the destruction of a wild animal? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was it. All the, all the, yeah. You need to call wait, me what? and answer some wait, questions. Wait. May I have a minute with the Queen of Queen take her away? Ladies and gentlemen, a final limerick for your enjoyment. <laughs> Ever make me. <laughs> 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 <laughs>